Okay, so I'll do a video of this uh, vacuum pump I got in the mail. The refrigeration type of vacuum pumps. I got it because I need to put a new compressor, AC compressor in my blazer because the one on there is seized up and there's no gas in it right now. So, and I need the vacuum pump so I can recharge it because I already got the gauge and everything to do it. So, this just came in the mail. The cat's interested. Comes with a bottle of oil. You can see it's vacuum pump oil. Instructions. Yeah, you get the point now. It's packed really well for shipping, which is a good thing. The box isn't damaged in any way. Yeah, I'll get it out of the plastic bag. You know. Well, here it is out of the bag. So, you get the information tag on it. It's 3.5 CFM at 5 PA, quarter horsepower, and 10 volts, 60 hertz. The on off switch in the back. Cooling motor for the fan. Seems fairly well built, considering it's Chinese, but I don't mind it. Being made in China. This plug, you got the two ports. Your gauge, there's one for a, a bigger gauge type to gauge or vacuum hose to go on. And you got the little port for your charging gauges. I have these. Really old. I got them at a flea market. They're old. R12, R22, and R502 gauges. And I got the R134A adapters on them. And this is the middle one, is your vacuum. If you used to back down the system, that just goes on here. That just goes on there like that. So, yeah, you get the point. There's your like exhaust muffler, you got a cap on it, which you got to pull off before using it just to keep junk out of it. So, I'm not really sure where you add the oil to, I haven't looked yet, so, yes, I'll do that next and we'll turn it on. So I got oil in it, Let's see, in the side glass, right there, it didn't, it didn't use all of the bottle, I still got, I still got some left over for topping it up later, see right there, but, got it plugged in, got the, one of the ports off so it doesn't pull a vacuum on itself, and take the glass cap on, I guess it will. Turn it on then. It's very quiet. So I guess I'll put my gauges on, see how much vacuum it. Pulls. I got the gauges on. It's the vacuum gauge is open, so let's turn it on, see how much vacuum it pulls. There you go, it's all the vacuum. It's under vacuum now. Seems to be holding vacuum, so yeah. So that's it. Thanks for watching.